Hi girls, so welcome to our fifth training element of the term, our circuit training. So circuit training, as we mentioned before, is a combination of all of our exercises that we've done already, and we're gonna go over them again. So ignore my table here, it's just a nice big box um, that I used to jump on. What you need today is your water bottle, always stay hydrated, some form of weights. So I have dumbbells, but I want uh, you guys to see, I'm using coconut milk uh, containers today, so that's what we're gonna be using for our workout. You have the stuff at home, you can definitely do this. So the way that the circuit training works is we're going to do a strength move, and then we're gonna follow it with 40 seconds of cardio, which is our nice little cardio burst of the circuit training. Okay, so we are going to start off with just a little bit of a warm up. We're not going to do too much here, but just on the spot, we are just doing some step out jacks. The reason we do a warm up is we want to increase our heart rate, reduce uh, injury, bring some heat to our muscles, and get the flexibility of them going a bit again. Okay, so we're going to go three, two, one. Let's do some arm swings. We are going to be doing some bit of arm workout today. So we want to make sure we're loose and limber here. Just want you to uh, swing those arms back in a circle like you're in a pool. Brilliant. Let's bring them forward now. Actually in a pool now. Okay, I want to just come to our hips. We're just going to do a few hip circles. Just really loosen our joints first there. Let's go the other way. And we're going to do one more uh, hip junction, just across and over, little steps between. Then we're pretty much ready to get started. So make sure you have your weights ready. We do need them for this workout. And then we are good to go. So I will do all the timing here. One more, um, and the counting. So our first thing that we are going to do is take our cans or our dumbbells, whatever we have. We're going to do a lunge with a bicep curl. So our lunge, we're going to step a leg back or forward, whatever you prefer. And as we go down, we're bicep curling up like that, okay? So we are going to do 10 of those followed by 40 seconds of jumping jacks. Uh, let me see my best way to show you my feet here. <laughs> okay, here we go. That's one, two, keep your arms contracted, three, four, knee behind ankle, five, six, seven, eight, nine, last one, 10. Perfect, put your weights down and move my table out of the way. 40 seconds here, we have jumping jacks. Let's go. So these little bursts in our circuit training really elevate our heart rate and will help us burn some fat, some calories, keep our metabolism going throughout the rest of the day. A little longer than it would if we were just standing around or sitting around all day. So we're gonna keep going here. I know you can do this. It's only 40 seconds every few minutes, so you can definitely handle it. Let's keep going. And done. Good. Catch your breath. We're on to our next exercise. Grabbing our weights again, we are going to do squat and press. So what's happening here? Our weights are around our shoulder. We're getting in our squat position. Plant those feet firmly, heels on the ground. Toes are pointing away. We're gonna go down and press our weights above our head, squeezing everything at the top. Okay? And move myself back here. Are we ready? We're doing 10 of those. All right, squat, one, two, chest up, three, 
four, five, great job, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Brilliant stuff. Those of you who are using dumbbells, you probably are feeling that a little bit. Okay, into 40 seconds, high knees. Here we go. So just put your hands here. Your legs might not get there. If you can, try to really tap those knees. It's okay if not, you could just be like jogging on the squat. Just want to pull those legs up. No shame if your knees are not getting super high. We want to avoid injury. So just making sure those feet are coming off the ground. Can go here if you want to create a little beat. <laughs> Let's keep it going. Five seconds left. Three, two, and one. Well done. Okay. If you have a light weight, we are going to do something called overhead sit-ups. If your weight is very heavy, please do not use it. Okay? You'll just do regular sit-ups. So, if you have a weight that's light enough, you'll hold your weight up as you are sitting up, staying over your head. If not, regular sit-ups, okay? Let's go, we have 10 of these. Here we go. One, two, good work. Three, four, looking up, five, six, just above our knees, seven, eight, nine, 10. Fantastic. Okay. 40 seconds of skipping on the spot. Let me get my timer ready. Let's go. So once again, we're getting that jump motion, trying to increase our heart rate, our cardiovascular work. Oh God, here we go, be quieter. Um, trying to really get that, that heart pounding. If this becomes too much for you, alternate feet. If it's too easy for you, try a double jump rope, okay? If you're good where you are, keep it up. Doing fantastic. Let's keep it going. And rest. Well done, okay. Last exercise of the circuit, and we will repeat, or last combo, I guess I should say. Take your weights. We are just doing bicep curls. So what we're gonna do, hugging our arms, our elbows into our side, planting our feet, and we're going to curl up, okay? We don't wanna do this, it'll hurt our back, and it's not gonna work our biceps, which are our intended muscles to work, okay? I'll get set for you. Nice slight bend in the legs, the knees. And let's go. One, down slow. Two, three, four. Good work. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Brilliant stuff. Okay, we have 40 seconds of work here. I'm just gonna show you what we're doing. So we're doing interims to a jump. So an interim, climbing ourselves out, bringing ourselves back. We'll do a little jump at the end. We're getting ourselves prepared for half burpees and burpees, which we will do one day when we are all together again. Okay, here we go. All right, down. Gonna reach out here. Crawl our hands back in, jump. It's okay if you bend your legs a bit, no problem. Jump, if you can keep them straighter, that's great too, it just depends on how flexible we are. Let's keep going, up, 
Well, I don't know where my timer is. <laughs> Just kidding, I'll, I'll help you get out of it. Let's keep going. And up. Let's go another one. And up and done. Whew, that was a close one. Okay, we are going to run through our circuit one more time, a little faster this time, okay? With our lunges and our bicep curls. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good stuff. 40 seconds of jumping jacks. Okay, let's go. So we're going to just move through this circuit a little faster now. You know what to expect. You know the exercises that we're doing. So we're just going to speed it up a bit and really elevate our fitness a little more. Doing great. Keep it up. This is about less than 20 minutes. So we want to work as hard as we can to get that benefit. It's the only time of the day that we're forced off our seats. So let's use it and rest. Whew. Okay. Grabbing our weights again. We are into our squat and press. Once again, feet planted. Try to turn your toes out. Weights are engaged at our shoulders. We're not gonna drop them. We're keeping them here. Move back it and let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Brilliant. All right, back to our high knees. We're jogging on the spot. Let's go. So it's a little different than just jogging on the spot. Jogging on the spot would be down here. High knees, we're making that effort to bring our knees up. So we're gonna keep this going. For anyone who has been using dumbbells, fantastic. It's a little tougher with dumbbells, of course, um, because they have more weight to it, but it's totally okay if you do not have them. We can use these household items. It's brilliant. You have five seconds left here. Let's go. And rest. Unreal, good job. All right, we're on the ground for our overhead sit-ups. <laughs> Grab my handy weight and plant our feet. We have 10 sit-ups here. Let's go. One, two, exhaling on our way up. Four, five, <laughs> that's my exhale. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Woo! -woo. Okay. 40 seconds here, skipping on the spot. Then we have two more moves after this and we are done. D-U-N, done. Of course, that's not how you actually spell it. Okay, let's skip and wipe our sweat away. <laughs> if you wanna make skipping more fun, you can go out and in. One, two, three, four. Pretend you're actually skipping. Crisscrossing, side to side, butt to butt, whatever is going to keep you moving. I always pretend I have a skipping rope in my hand. It works our arms, our biceps, our shoulders, and it makes me feel like I'm not working. So it's a little 
more enjoyable. And rest. Okay, we have our regular bicep curls. Planting our feet, slight bend in our knees, holding them, our elbows tight to our body. Let's go. Use this time to recover your breath. Two, three, four, and five. Out nice and slow. Six, because we have cardio coming up. Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Perfect, that was nice and slow, no swinging motions. All right, 40 seconds of our interim to our jumps, then we are on to the cool down. Let's go, girls. Climbing out, back in, jump. This is a great full body stretch here when we do our interims. We have our legs engaged, our arms, our abs. Everything's working hard. Let's keep it going. And it will prepare us for our more dynamic moves in the future. In round two of everything. Let's go, let's go one more. Come on. And up. Woo! Well done, girls. 17 and a half minutes of work. We are going to just do a little breather. So I want you to think about in through the nose, out through the mouth. So here we go. And out. If you want to close your eyes, do it in. And out. This will slow our heart rate down. In again. And out. Okay. Take some normal breaths. Good. We want to cool down our body, but it's really hard to cool down our body. Keep breathing here. If we're <laughs> holding stretches. <laughs> so that's why we want to take a few cognizant breaths. So breaths that we're paying attention about, just calm ourselves down. And again, and out. Okay, it was not a long workout today. So we're just going to Bring those arms up, bring them back down, tie them behind our body here for a nice little stretch. Perfect. Okay, let's just step our legs out. We're going to reach our hand down one side here, stretching our other hand over. So wherever we can reach to, but keep our body straight. We don't want to turn like that. Okay, let's cartwheel over to the other side. Things are cracking on me, it's because I'm old. Perfect. Just going to reach down wherever we feel a nice pull in the back of our legs. Okay, and add just a little stretch here, side to side. Good, come back up. Going to heel toe our feet in. Do, 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 do. Hold here. Up slow, 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 slow. One breath in together and arms up. Ready? And out. Thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you next week.